Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Group Vice President and General Manager, Lexis, Mark Templin. Good morning, everyone, and thanks for joining us. You know, over the last few years, our talented designers in Japan, France, and the U.S. have worked together to bring passion and excitement to our stunning concept vehicles, the LFLC and LFCC, and to our recently introduced production models like the GS, the ES, and the LS. The IS represents a great global opportunity for us. Since its debut in 1999, it's provided an entry point into the Lexus brand for youthful, performance-oriented consumers. In fact, the current generation IS has the youngest buyer of any car in the entire luxury industry. And this new IS will give these customers even more of what they want. Let's take a look. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2014 IS350 F-Sport. To be competitive in this segment, you have to have a great looking car that's fun to drive and offers a true luxury and a value proposition, and the IS delivers them all. It announces its presence with the boldest expression yet of our signature spindle grille. With L-shaped LED daytime running lights placed independently below the headlamps, the overall dynamic shape of the body emphasizes the wide flare of the wheel arches to give it a broad, powerful stance. And take a look inside. The LFA-inspired cockpit features the refinement you'd expect of a Lexus, and it puts the driver in the perfect ergonomic position to attack the road. With a longer wheelbase, rear seat legroom has been increased nearly three inches. And for the first time, IS will feature 60-40 split folding rear seats further enhancing the flexibility and cargo capacity of the new larger trunk. Now, as you might expect, this car is loaded with new technology. The meter cluster is all LFA. Check it out. The thin film transistor display moves in concert with a sliding bezel, adding a sporty and high-tech touch to the instrumentation. And thanks to the new electrostatic switch technology, the climate control system can be adjusted with a simple slide of the finger. The IS also has a new state-of-the-art multimedia system. In an industry first, our new system provides subscription-free traffic and weather information delivered through the HD radio service on all of our audio systems. Vehicles with navigation feature Lexus Inform, providing onboard access to a variety of popular apps. And it's all controlled with our second generation remote touch interface. Now, not only does the IS look great, I can't wait for you to drive it. The IS350 F-Sport is powered by a direct and port-injected 3.5-liter V6 engine delivering more than 300 horsepower. And this power plant is mated to the same eight-speed automatic transmission in the ISF high-performance sedan, delivering quicker shifts, full torque converter lockup, and manual mode throttle blips. The drive mode select offers four different modes to suit the driver's preferred combination of fuel economy, comfort, performance, and handling. The double wishbone front suspension system has been re-engineered, offering a 20% increase in sway rigidity. And the rear adopts a new multi-link suspension system taken from the GS, resulting in outstanding grip performance and excellent response to steering inputs. Also from the GS, the power steering system has been tuned to enhance steering feel and response. The all-new IS will go on sale in the US in June. Now, earlier I talked about the importance of IS for us on a global basis. One of the key benefits to having a global product portfolio strategy is that it gives us the flexibility to offer the right vehicles at the right time in the right markets in direct response to customer needs. A prime example of this approach is our first ever IS hybrid. The IS300H will be available in Japan, where a majority of the vehicles we sell are hybrids, and in Europe and other international markets where CO2 emissions drive buying behavior. The full hybrid system combines a powerful electric motor with a newly developed 2.5-liter four-cylinder Atkinson cycle engine, featuring a new D4S fuel injection system, dual VVTi, 
and a high-efficiency ga uh, exhaust gas recirculation system. And while we can't disclose actual numbers until later this spring, I can tell you that we're targeting CO2 emissions lower than 100 grams per kilometer and fuel consumption of less than 4.3 liters per 100 kilometers while delivering total system power of 162 kilowatts. And I know those of you in the audience from Europe know exactly how impressive that is. The IS300H receives all of the same handling enhancements of the IS250 and the IS350 and will also be available in an F-Sport model. Now, we expect the hybrid to make up more than 80% of the mix in Europe, and it'll contribute greatly to our global growth. And we expect great things from the entire lineup of IS, and we look forward to getting you all behind the wheel. Before I invite you up to stage to take a closer look, please allow the photographers to get a few shots first, and then come join us. Thanks for, for being here, and enjoy the rest of the show. <laughs>